All right, fellow champions, it's me, Johnny, the champion within. I'm live here. Nobody's in, but it's kind of early. It is actually 8.20. We got 10 minutes before the 5K starts. I'm feeling pretty good. Slept pretty good last night. Uh, hip and knee are fine today. I bought some uh, uh, pads to go in my um, shoes, like heel, heel um, gel pads. Try to take some of the pressure off my hips and my knees. I'm real bad about doing a heel strike when I run. And so I've got that... Uh, Hopefully, I dressed a little bit today. Put some new pads in my shoes last night. Ate a good meal last night. Had a little bit to eat today. I uh, drank my last LMNT salty, stay salty drink about 30 minutes ago. The race is fixing to start. I do have my water bottle with some more electrolytes. Uh, feeling pretty good. Like I say, going for a 55 minute time. But if I don't, if I don't uh, make the 55 minute time, no big deal. I just want to finish. Don't forget, I got to work a 10 hour shift later today. I got to be at work at 12, work 12 to 10 at the road at Lowe's. But uh, pretty excited, ready to get this race started. I've been here for about an hour. Uh, I'm always, you know, always real early because I'm afraid I'm going to be late. So I always get places way too early. But I've never been late from anything. So I guess it works out. You got one person in here. Thank you so much. I uh, can't see, uh, I don't know how to do this. I don't, I don't know how to um, see the comments. But anyway. Whew. Just trying to stay calm. Got the first race of 2024 coming up. I may do one more this year. Well, I know I'm going to do two more. I'm going to do the one in Mayberry or Mount Airy. And then I plan on doing the one in Concord. But those are, you know, in October, November of this year. So this might be the last one for a while. Just got to really focus on uh, being strict on my diet and really serious about uh, if I'm going to do this, try to get more serious about it. Try to, you know, See if I can't move up within my age group. I usually finish in the last three or four spots in my age group, which is fine. Uh, and one last thing, don't forget I'm in, I'm in AFib. I woke up in AFib. I'm going to go to bed tonight in AFib. I don't see any of that changing. So that makes this a little tougher, but um, still doable. I mean, obviously, if it wasn't doable, I wouldn't be here. I'm glad I did my two uh, practice runs, the 2.1 mile. The course today is different from what I've been running. It's going to be a good bit more on the road, hopefully less on that gravel, that loose gravel just makes things so tough man you you're putting all that effort into it and your feet are spinning in that loose gravel so it's like all the effort you're putting in is not actually uh not actually you know propelling you forward like it would if, if you were on the road or on a like hard pack or something like that but anyway i've rambled enough thank you guys for uh, checking in i got three of y'all in here and um hey abby 99 aby 99 not a whole lot getting ready to run this 5k feeling good uh the weather is great i woke up this morning here in charlotte it was 50 degrees that's right 50 probably the coldest it's been in a while and it's probably mid 60s right now i think it's supposed to get up to 79 or 80 later on today but the weather is a uh, chamber of commerce